What's up? It's time for Chapter 5, The Darkness of Hades. Um, like I said before, I really hope the rest of this game doesn't just turn into running away from a monster for five chapters. But we'll see what happens here. I don't care. She's gone, Aubrey. I was too late. But she's gone. I know, I know. But you made a promise, Rose. <laughs> you selfish fuck. And everything. <laughs> if you don't leave now, they will get you too. Promise. Come on. Get up and get out. The left side door. Go. It's convenient that everything is like a hundred times darker now. Heard. Continue towards guess... the physics department. Once you've gotten me out of here. I'm not going to the engine halls, Aubrey. In that room anyway. But, but you said you promised. I know, Aubrey. I, I know. And I will stay true to my word. But my sister asked me to do one last thing for her. I have to do this first, Aubrey. Family first. I understand. Where do you need to go? The theater. How do I get there? Get that physics department door open while I work out how to get you to the theater. I'll be right back. So you can't open any of these doors, I'm assuming, obviously, because they're all red lights. And usually, even if there's dialogue, this game would have let you interact with an object, so... Are there any pneumatic message tubes? Any collectibles anywhere? If you want to get, have a good time, you should see how badly this game runs on Series X. like 20 frames per second solid if you're lucky sometimes it's 60 a lot of times it just drops or stays you know below 20 or 30 or at least it looks that way um, I don't have the FPS thing running obviously but I can tell it's just a walk up to the electricity what? I just don't like games that force you to run away from shit, like, especially when your run speed is so insanely slow. Resident Evil 7 and Resident Evil 8, I give those a pass, obviously, because that's not the entire game. And you have a gun and, and stuff like that. Anyway, even though it doesn't really do anything, like, at least it feels like you're yourself. Okay, I think I've got a solution, Rose. You there? Yeah, I'm here. Something is burning, though. Oh, yeah. That would be the reactor core. This is ground zero where it all began. Turns out the fire we lit just kept on burning. It's been consuming the Helios from within for days. Don't breathe the fumes. Highly inadvisable. Easier said than done. <coughs> 
you had a way for me to get to the theater? I do, but you're not going to like it. Come on. Is this Hit like me. ectoplasm? <laughs> What's you see where all the smoke and fire is coming from? Well, we're going to walk you straight through the middle of it. <coughs> I hate this place. It gets worse. The reactor core is shielded, so the receiver won't work once you're down there. You'll have to traverse the flames on your own. I'm going to monitor the exotic energy spread behind you, see if I can contain it. I'll talk to you on the other side. <sighs> okay. Any last minute advice? Don't burn up. It honestly feels like half of this game is walking around waiting for this guy to stop talking. Um, anyway, I was going to say, I, I like these games that have this Art Deco style because they always have these like motivational posters or whatever you want to call them. They're always interesting to look at. So one of these should have a message, right? You know what? Because there's supposed to be an achievement for the pneumatic tube messages. Well, I guess it doesn't matter since this is the PC version on on Xbox and there aren't any achievements anyway because for whatever reason they're not there. Uh, but it makes it easier to play it through again on on Xbox and know where things are. Do not open the core, leave it sealed if you are reading this effect. One, two, two, three. Yeah, Archer. Okay, so I gotta go up the smoky staircase. I have to go like literally through all the shit. Ah, the ledge. What would a game be without uh, shimmying? Shimmying. Shimmying. <laughs> no game is complete without it. For fucks. Not that way. I'm not a big fan of when games force you to walk through like fiery rooms where you can't see anything. But to their credit, um, it's actually pretty well done. Like it, Impossible to see anything almost. Go to the theater and get the second notebook. Together they hold the keys to everything. 
Do they hold the keys to giving me, like, spectral assault rifle to take care of these guys? I doubt that. Okay, so now I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. This is a dead end. I'm trapped here. That's, there's, there's no direction to go in. Aggravating to say the least. You see, the thing is, I went this way, like, 15 times I went this way. Whatever. Just fucking cut all that bullshit. It's infuriating. Dimensional physicist? Yeah, I don't think those were a thing. Even in the 18- especially in the 1800s. <laughs> 